Let's play a game. Can you guess the influential woman I'm describing? Number one, her mom was born in Puerto Rico, her dad to a Puerto Rican family in the Bronx. Number two, she became the youngest woman elected to the U.S. House of Representatives. And three, she is now in her third term advocating for a Green New Deal. Can you guess who it is? It's AOC. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez was born in 1989, two years after the first female justice, Sandra Day O'Connor, was sworn into office. AOC was raised in the Bronx to a family that fluctuated above and below the poverty line. Her mother, Blanca, worked in secretarial and cleaning work, while her father, Sergio, was an architect. The thought of being suited for politics did not even cross her mind as a child. During her first campaign to represent the Bronx in the House of Representatives, she shocked many by winning with, as New York Times wrote, an informal, flexible, structured campaign movement. Beating the incumbent, Joe Crowley, was a huge win for Alexandria, but also for many young girls, this brought to light that they too have the opportunity to be recognized. Today, there are 125 women in Congress, which is roughly 27%. Because women are still far away from equality in the government, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez will continue to carry on with saying that having a woman in a position of power is still something that is uncharted territory in America.